So hello and welcome to this uh, Adobe Animate uh, quick tutorial and I already created a long version of this tutorial and I am going to show you this and I am going to provide the link in the description. Uh, so right now I will show you what we are going to be doing today. And uh, now I will show you the long version of this tutorial. Uh, so right now I'm not going to show you how you can adjust this in Illustrator and I'm not going to show you how you can export this to Google Ads. I will, I will only show you very quickly the animation. Uh, so I will go to the Adobe Animate and I'm going to create a new document and I will go with uh, 300 by uh, 600 uh, like uh, so. And uh, I am going to provide you an uh, Illustrator file in the description. Uh, you can go ahead and uh, work with the free pick file. I am going to also provide that one. Uh, but I am going to provide you this one. And I am going to drag it to the Adobe Animate like so. And I am just going to click Import. And we are basically going to have uh, two layers. And I am going to click anywhere. I will go to the properties and I will change the color of the background to maybe something like this. And uh, right now this uh, shadow looks very bad. So I can go ahead and double click and uh, until I will get to that and I can change the color of the shadow a little bit uh, like so but that's not the point of this tutorial so I will go back to the scene one and now I will convert both of these uh, things to the symbol uh, so f8 or uh, modify convert to symbol and symbol one is fine and I will click on the tooth f8 and symbol two is fine and uh, I will go ahead and click on this drill and with Q uh, free transform tool I will scale this little bit uh, like uh, so and position it uh, now I will go to the, my timeline and I will go maybe to frame uh, 200 and I am going to extend the timeline with uh, F5 or the right click insert frame and now what I can do is uh, I can go uh, ahead and maybe at least uh, rename one of my layers so this is going to be drill and uh, I will go to maybe frame 50 and I'm going to create new keyframe F6 or the right click insert keyframe and I will go to the first keyframe and I'm going to position this uh, up outside of the stage and if you don't see things outside of the stage there is this clip content outside of the stage I'm going to position it in here and I'm going to uh, click in between right click and create classic twin so basically we are going to have this kind of animation and maybe what I could do is click on the first keyframe go to the classic ease and choose this easing easy out basically this means that it will uh, slow down at the end of the animation so it will go like so and then uh, it will be like in the middle of the animation it will be slowing like so and now the the vibration uh, or shaking of the tooth so that's a very simple frame by frame animation uh, so I'm going to click F6 to create new keyframe and then I'm going to create uh, click F6 one more time and it should create me new keyframe like so and with my arrows I'm just going to position this little bit like so and F6 and I'm going to position this little bit F6 and I'm going to posi position it and uh, like so you can play with this and we are going to create maybe 8, 9, 10 keyframes I don't know uh, so something like this and uh, one more time and now what I'm going to do uh, is I'm going to get all of this like so with the shift and with the alt I am going to duplicate this and right now I'm going to select everything like so and with alt I am going to duplicate this and I can do this maybe one or two more times so I'm going to duplicate this and maybe I can do this uh, one more time so this is going to be a little bit longer and I'm going to position it like so and right now I'm going to hit control enter and we are going to have uh, something like uh, this uh, so yeah uh, if you want uh, you can go ahead and watch the long version of the tutorial uh, in that one I explained a lot of the stuff uh, right now I wanted to only show you something like this uh, so this is it uh, thank you very much for watching and uh, hopefully I will see you in some other tutorial thank you goodbye